Hey what is up guys and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video I'm going to start my custom car showcase videos basically in this series. We're just going to be taking cars from Gran Turismo 7, giving them a bit of a tuning up overhaul and just kind of giving them a showcase really. Um, I feel like the car customization in this game is maybe not the best but you can certainly make some pretty awesome looking cars especially in the sense of you know JDM vehicles. And we're going to start off with something nice and simple, a classic Honda Civic Type R. So we put all the upgrades we could on and gave it some new shoes. Obviously a nice wide body and pretty much just a, a few kind of subtle changes to give it that kind of race car for the road look. Um, for me, I think it looks quite clean, quite smooth, but also looks like it means business. Um, also got that nice looking stance look to it. Um, but we'll kind of obviously change up the suspension when it comes to, you know, racing and such. Um, obviously take away that stance look and give it a more track look. So first up I went and tested it in time trial and it certainly performed like I expected. Um, very loud, very fast um, and very nimble. It's kind of all you really want from this Type R. Um, and personally I think it felt amazing. Um, not in the fact that obviously we've just got full performance mods on it and it's going to feel much quicker um, But it felt very very planted to the road. So definitely, you know functioning as it should really and um, definitely you know, suits the nighttime look around Tokyo Expressway So I'm gonna go quiet for a bit and let you have a listen to the pretty awesome loud sound of this thing And then obviously we'll come back and see how it performed in a race So then I decided to take it into an arcade mode race around Tokyo, set the difficult to professional and still managed to wipe the floor with all these AI. For some reason Gran Turismo has this weird little thing where it kind of, even if you put mods on the car, keeps you in kind of cars it thinks the standard model would be competitive with. So I'm not going to show the full race because, you know, after pretty much lap one we just run away with it. But, you know, it was pretty awesome to see uh, just how much these tuning upgrades improved the car as we pretty much ate everything up that we sometimes shouldn't be. Obviously, flown past the old Supra, um, taking on obviously 208 GTIs and such. No problem, no body roll at all. Obviously, pretty much sat on the ground. And there we go, <laughs> into the lead within half a lap. So, no complaints in the performance department. Uh, definitely performed well in a race, uh, much better than I expected. Um, but you know, I think it'd perform, I guess, a bit more on par in a custom race. But you know, that's not the point, it's obviously all about showcasing what these cars are about and basically just seeing how you can wipe the floor with the AI in custom cars. So, yeah, awesome little car, awesome sound, and just I love the way it looks. So that is going to be the end of the video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll leave you with pretty much, I guess, escapes of our creation. Cheers, guys.